Hey, orange one here. So we are um, kind of in an interesting situation. I don't know how this cohesion mechanic is really going to work with our companions. I'm pretty sure we can split them and then just put the party back together. We're going to find out about that soon. But um, for now, we need to recover from the last episode. We uh, There was quite a bit of fighting there. And we have, I think... I think maybe half of our troops died. Maybe not half, but half of them are like not able to fight right now. So if we look at our party right now, yeah, about half of us are injured pretty badly too. So maybe we should just kind of rest up in the city. Yeah, let's kind of start off and we'll, we'll do that. We'll just kind of wait here um, so I can kind of tell you the game plan. Uh, basically... What we have right here is we got, um, we just really crushed them. So we should kind of be pushing an advantage that we've got right now. I do want to kind of heal up a little bit and then we'll go up north. And we will probably um, need to defend Legata again against another attack is what I'm thinking. But we'll leave like in the morning. Yeah. Okay, that looks pretty good for now. Uh maybe we can try and recruit people no it looks like i thought i saw our, our companions were recruiting people so i think they went and grabbed up all the available recruits uh, i am gonna go back in here and see if any new local people yeah are available for hire great i would love to be able to hire more um but unfortunately these villages all hate us for some reason Let's go up to Legata, and I think probably other people in our faction are pushing the advantage uh, that was created by the defeat of that one army, but at the same time, I'm not really sure. And uh, why is that marked as their quest? Uh, train troops. Oh, yeah, there was some dude right over there that was like, hey, could you train our troops? Oh, speaking of which, we did get a skill in between things uh the stewardship skill um or no it's the is it the leadership skill yes so now everyone gets a little bit of experience every day and i want to go with like the higher end one because i think i'm gonna have some higher end units myself sure help them <laughs> i don't see why like if we get any experience from that i'd be shocked that was not really a, a real fight. Um, yeah, it's... Oh, we actually did get a little experience. Okay. Let's have a look at the army. If I go to Kingdom and I look at my army here... Um, Rodan, I've got 192. Okay. 192, that's, that's respectable, right? Definitely gonna need to recover though with some of these guys. I need more cannon fodder. Or arrow fodder, I should say, right? Not cannons. They don't have cannons in this world, but it's like Roman times. Come on, orange one. I kinda wanna see I don't think that I've raided like these places too much, but it looks like that may have yeah, it's been raided recently. I might just go harass some of these villages and kind of see uh, what comes of that, you know? Oh, the Kuzates just defeated the Southern Empire in some sort of battle. Yeah, nobody's available there. It's a shame. Uh, wow, things are expensive there. Can I catch those looters? I don't think I can, but no, I totally can. Great. Yeah, let's get some experience. Yeah, I think Rodan, if he can, is going to move away from the raiding. So I think I'm going to go into enemy territory and maybe hunt down the lords that are going to be around here. And caravans. And yeah, it's a, yes, perfect like that. Uh, 4.8. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. Is it that I'm just running through the woods? Yeah, okay, so actually we should be able to catch you pretty easily too, actually. And look, we get, we're getting these uh, these recruits. 
Yeah, if I fail that one quest because these guys all died, I'm fine with that. I just honestly want to, um... I just want to get our ourselves a city or something at this point, and to do that we're gonna have to be pretty aggressive. Oh, there's actually a hundred people there. I mean, I could maybe take it, but the problem is is that it would immediately fall to the enemy. Yeah. Yeah, the... Um, oh, I did see that there's... <laughs> you can uh, attack these guys and then um, let some of them escape. And then you can trade them the goods that you just... Uh, like, you know... Um, took from them. <laughs> it's awful, I know. Take over command! Oh man, this is gonna be we're just gonna overrun them so much. I just kinda wanted to see it. You know, now that I've I've got this computer that I built for this, just for the sole purpose of this game. And I've got a hundred something units, and by George, I am going to see it. I'm gonna see those units. So, let's see. What do we have here? Yeah, th this cab is not going to last too long. Actually, so oh, I got a hit there. It looked to me like there was a frame drop there, but I mean, it's saying that we're getting like 100 frames, so I don't think that that really makes sense. Okay, that's, um... Oh, actually, these are my dudes. I just totally am getting all thrown off because I don't have the indicator on to show that they're part of my faction or not. Actually, I think that dude's part of my, my faction. I might want to turn that indicator back on. It kind of adds, though, to it, doesn't it? Not really knowing if they're your friend or not. Go, having to go by the shield colors. Yeah, there's, uh... That dude, probably. Oh, nope. Oh, jeez. There's actually a ton of them arching at us right now. It's weird how the sound doesn't go through, like, a good chunk of the time. Oh, I just killed one of my Asari Mamluks, I'm pretty sure. Okay, these dudes are dead. There's no way you're getting away. There we go. Nice and clean. Oh, come on. Somebody's gotta get him. And that somebody is me. Okay. Caravan is down. I actually don't think they got away at all. Any of them were able to retreat. Probably for the best, though. I think... I am going to take some prisoners, but just really with the intention of recruiting them. So we'll take... Actually, we'll take all of those. None of you are Empire. Woodland's Garment. That actually is better... Uh, than I thought it would be. Cool. Okay, well, um, does that help with my cohesion at all, or is that just gonna constantly go down? I think I think it's just gonna constantly go down. Yeah, I just need to keep an eye on these prisoners of mine. I got a feeling they will eventually let us, um, I forgot my, what I was saying. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, defenders, do I want to besiege them? I mean, I think having a 2 to 1 ratio is probably good enough. But the AI tends to do more than a 2 to 1 ratio. So I'm not sure. I mean, they are just militia. But we are also kind of crummy troops ourselves. Let's not siege, not with our current forces. We'll just keep on looking, um... I'm gonna leave the looters. I'm gonna let them harass villagers. I think nah, never mind. They're just like free experience. Come on, no, never mind. We're gonna leave them. We can't catch them. They're too fast. There was a group up here that I thought I saw like a lord, like on the other side of the river. Right? Oh look, there's silver ore. They, these villages are like undefended. I don't think I want to ruin my my honorable name. Oh, okay, look, this guy is an army of 40. 
Oh yeah, we could totally catch that. You're part of the Northern Empire. Well, that's who I'm at war with right now, right? I just want to make sure... Okay, yeah. I'll, I'll recruit you. And if I'm looking at our speed, we're at 4.71. Yeah, this dude, we're not going to be able to catch... Um, not the speed. Though, let's just kind of check if I get rid of these prisoners. Can I go to 4.8? I can, actually. I can get to 4.8. Um, I'm going to see... No, I got to get rid of all of them. Yeah, it's the 4.8. Let's see if we can catch this dude. I got a feeling he's gotta be able to get to the castle. Yeah, no, he's not able to get to the entrance. Nice. Okay, uh, is this dude... There's just, like, villagers over there. I think I'm gonna attack the, the mercenary. Let's see what we can get from him. I got a pretty good feeling about this. I think, yeah, we just need to uh, take out their, um their armies at this point with the force that we have uh yeah we're gonna get in there these dudes actually have real units so we d we want to get as many um follow your sergeants yeah follow the sergeants we want to get as much uh experience in here and have it avoid hitting our like pathetically trained troops Uh, sorry, just give me a second. Okay, so let's see. What were we doing? We were going after... Not mercenary. Oh yeah, it was a... Uh, it was a group of mercenaries. It wasn't the um, caravan. Are you really gonna get that close? You really are confident, aren't you? Are these guys retreating? No, they're not retreating. I was about to say, what's going on with you guys? What's your game plan here? Are they all melee? They've got no range. Okay, they've got one range, dude. Yeah, this is a... Uh... I almost feel bad about this. These dudes are gonna get crushed. I might just let them feed the army. Yeah, I'm just gonna get a couple shots off at them and let them feed the army. Oh, never mind. I'm just gonna kill like a ton of them. There we go. Yeah. Good luck. <laughs> yeah, if they're gonna retreat at this point, I'm gonna get some experience. There we go. Might as well. There we go. Yeah, I do gotta say that I get really confused not having the banners on. Oh man, that did not look like a good way to die. Sorry, bud. Okay. Yeah, I think... We'll keep all of our prisoners because it's basically more people to recruit. And then we'll just dump them if we get to the point where we have to turn around and get out of here. Oh, Flint Tolg Castle. Also, this has a hundred people. Um. Hmm. I would like to. I would like to besiege a castle, but I just don't think that we'd actually be able to take it with the units that we got. And the experience that they have, or lack of experience, I should really say. We'll just keep on wandering around. We'll keep on going around the countryside, seeing who uh, we spot. Redown gains a level. Maybe we should get closer to the, the front of the war. Oh, our leadership just gained. I think we're getting leadership pretty quick now that we're leading this army. Uh, another skill point. Do I want to pop it into leadership? Um... It only increases your garrison size. I don't, I don't know if it's going to be worth it to increase that. I could also go for charm. That was kind of fun playing around with that in the other episode. 
Engineering also would probably be not a half bad choice. Let's go with leadership. Let's just make it so that we can have even bigger battles. I, I wonder if that effect gets uh, more pronounced as you get a bigger party or not. Probably, right? Okay, look. A couple opportunities there. Uh, daily mor Where's my morale, actually? Food variety could be higher. I, You know what? We're going to start being a good dude and we're gonna start buying things from the enemy villages look at how uh how kind we are i mean we we trade with you right um i don't think i'm gonna be able to recruit troops though yeah i didn't think so they they're not gonna let me hire people from here they're not that dumb uh yeah we failed that one quest where we were supposed to train people um, just get things going. Oh, look, I I think I've beat you before. You're chasing me? Wait, why are you chasing me? That seems like a really bad idea for you. Is it because there's the defenders of this village? Is that really what's uh, going on here? Dude, if you, uh, you want to go, we can go. Yeah, you're just gonna stand there. Yeah, you're trying to run away from me. That's why I thought I'm gonna try and get between you and the castle, and see if I can actually um, catch you. No, he's going for the castle. He's gonna get in there. Four point six compared to the four point seven. I bet if I just get rid of my prisoners, I can catch him. Yeah, let's uh, let's try and catch this guy. I think it's going to be worth it. If we get rid of all of these guys... No, we're still... Nah. I think we just need to recover from our fight. I think we're just a little too hurt from our fight. And also our army is... Its cohesion is kind of falling apart. So maybe we'll, uh, we'll just kind of keep on chasing after that dude. And hopefully as I recover... Yeah. We'll we'll be able to catch him. I thought that was gonna be the case. Yeah, I know that everyone online says that you should just go around executing the lords, but I think that actually is gonna make you weaker in the long run because then there's less people for you to recruit into your own empire. Sergeants, take command. And really, it's all about how many commanders that you have for the army size. As far as I can tell, you know, it just costs influence. So you can get a ton of people in you, your uh, faction, and then you could, like, in theory, just like have a ton of influence. And just use them for your wars, right? And so, I, on one hand, sure, yeah, you could go around just wiping everyone out, but one, that's that's mean, MK. And two, I actually don't think it's the the best move for a long-term campaign. Oh, almost gone. There, come on. Nope. Oh, ow. I think we could take down the horse, though. Pretty quickly here. Oh, actually, I think that this is the Lord. This is the Lord? I might be able to just kill the Lord. Yeah, go ahead and take a swing. Oh, nope. There we go. Yeah, I think... Yeah, I should probably try and take him out. Oh, there goes your, uh, there goes your entire army there, buddy. God. Well, it helps when you outnumber them three to one. Let's just say that, you know. Um, come on. There we go. There we go. And yeah, you're not. You can see why my uh, my roommate thought that this game was a little unfair, a little bit of a power fantasy. <laughs> One of my roommates in college, if you, yeah, probably is coming out of nowhere for you if, unless you've been listening carefully to previous episodes. One of my roommates uh, thought that War Warman was just like. 
the like peasant killer simulator like you just run around killing peasants it's like no that's not it that's just how i play <laughs> i mean for real though like you gotta hit the enemy troops where they're weak See, like that right there, there's no way we're taking that castle. Um, I just... Yeah, we're... We're hurting, but not as much as I thought we were, actually. Oh, um, someone from our empire got taken prisoner. I know how to do it in the old game, but there's there's gotta be a way for us to be able to see uh, like the log, like the chat log. If I go to like kingdom, no, it's not there. And it's not any of these menu items here. Maybe it's under quest? No, it's not under quest. It's a shame. Kind of confusing. Um, oh, that Ironmonger is actually starting to make some money. Oh, look at that S Sonala Brewer. I knew that was a good investment. I, I don't know if I did that on camera or not. I don't think I did, but I bought a brewery here. And there's like, I think, three villages that make grain that feed into Sonala. So they got a really good price on that. Um... We'll keep on kind of wandering around a little bit. I really want to attack that looter group. It looks like they're going to get it, though. I, I'm not going to disturb them. Okay, we just got some recruits there. Oh, that was interesting. So my companions can recruit from here. I just can't myself. Uh, hold on. Oh, I see the mountain range is preventing us from traveling from here to there, but we can go around. Oh, look at that. Oh, nice. Very tasty snack for us. Yeah, that dude did not see us coming. I think we'll be able to catch him, but he might be a little too fast for us, but he's also kind of an idiot in terms of map navigating. So we should be able to... Oh, wait, what? Are we at war with Batania? I guess we're at war with Batania now. I just saw them over there. Chasing after me. Wait, what? Okay, I was about to say, you're not going to start walking on the lake, are you? Cool. Um, wow, this is... This is super easy to just kind of smash these guys after... That last episode when we took out their that big army, I guess I kinda just Sergeants in charge! Scattered their forces, you know? Because all I've seen so far has been like armies of like 50 dudes or so, and they've been not the best units either. Um I actually think I'm gonna not turn on the banner indicators. It just looks so much better. I just need to be a little a little bit more careful about aiming, you know. Yeah, come over. Come here. Come here. <laughs> I totally did that. Did not do that on purpose, by the way. He just totally ran into that uh, a tree all by himself. Oh, there we go. Let's get the horseman a little bit. Oh, yeah. See, they've got recruits. This is not gonna go well for them. Like, they've got a bunch of recruits there. Yeah, we're just killing a ton of recruits, essentially, right now. So this must be one of the people that we uh, we defeated in that massive battle. Yeah, oh, jeez. That was actually super close, that arrow. Yeah, you guys, you should not be standing your ground right now. If I were you, I'd be falling back. Cool. All right. It's a. Uh, oh no! Nope, never mind. You're not one of them, are you? No. Yeah, it's really confusing with the horsemen, especially with all the chainmail, because like you don't get a lot of color on them. 
That looks pretty good. Okay, cool. Yeah, losing 14 is more than I was expecting to lose there, but... We'll take it. Yeah, it seems to me that by taking the prisoners and having them join up with us, we may be able to kind of indefinitely sustain ourselves. But we don't want to be slowed down by too many prisoners either. Yeah, 160 versus 47. I'm willing to take this, those odds. Uh, 3.5. Yeah, he's going to be just a little too fast for us. Um, let's see if we can get to... I think it's Vernon Castle. Or maybe even see if we could be a part of the Siege of... Done Glanis because that if that's their last city, if we can take that, then um yeah, then we're only at faction war with one faction. Oh wow, there's actually a ton of them all of a sudden around here. Uh this could be a problem for us. I mean I think that we're okay. Especially if those dudes kind of back off a little bit. Let's just kind of fall back so that we're not within the range of people that are... Oh, hideout spotted. Okay. I don't see it myself, but whatever. I think we can take like 120. The other group, though, that would be concerning to me. Uh, we do have a bit of a problem, though. It looks like a lot of them are coming after us. Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of our prisoners then. Did that speed me up at all? It did not. 3.25 uh, 3.27. Okay, well, getting rid of the prisoners isn't helping. I think we're going to maybe have to get rid of some of our wounded. Um, I'm gonna see if maybe we can go into this castle. They probably won't let me in, seeing how they hate me. Um, I might as well try. I mean, we can maybe get to Pen Canock. Yeah, they, they totally aren't gonna let me in there. Um, can I get over there? Is there any way that I can get over there? This is not looking good. I think the next episode might be starting with us getting into a big old fight. We'll see. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.